Ghostface and Michael Myers Collectors. Thank you again for joining me on another video on this beautiful Sunday. But before we start, please hit the like and subscribe button. It really helps the channel. Hit the bell notifications for when I upload new videos. Hit the comments below if you got any questions and share these videos. All right, so quick update. Apparently, Melissa Barrera got reached out by, um, um, what is it, Spyglass Media Group. They reached out to her to try to convince her or re, uh, what is it um renew her deal with um with spyglass and so she could you know obviously be in screen seven but um apparently she denied any interaction with them she doesn't want anything to do with them which is crazy and i understand too you know if i was her uh, i'd be like you know what the hell first you don't need me now you need me You're playing games back and forth you know it's like when your ex dumps you and then she goes back to try to get you back. It's the same concept. You know, you're obviously going to be like, hell no, for what? You know, for what? Unless, but this is a movie studio, though. But unless they pay her, you know, m more m more amount of money, I'm pretty sure she probably would be down. But nah, she she declines. She's not down. She's she's standing by what she says, standing her ground, as they say. Um, what else? Um, and yeah, she's keeping her freedom of speech. So it doesn't look like uh, she'll be returning for any Scream 7 now. Uh, Scream's pretty much in the, in the gutter right now. Yeah, like I said last time, it's, it's, it's done for now. It's done, it's done. Um, um, like I said last time, uh, I feel like a direct sequel to Scream 4 would work, but you would have to jump back in time, you know, in between before the new movie, in between 4 and Scream 5, you know, tell a story in between that time. But I don't think that's going to happen either. Um, a full reboot, I wouldn't be cool with that because Scream's always been a consistent um, consistent franchise with every every movie it has to do something with the last one. You know, there's there's never been a retcon for Scream like there is for Halloween or like or Jason Voorhees or Freddy Krueger, you know? Um, so that, that doesn't really work with Scream like that, you know, because it's always a different killer under the mask. It's never the same killer like michael jason and freddy you know who are one person ghost faces many people um yeah so apparently she's not down like i said i get it. i totally get it you know her decision and they also lost jenna in the process so like i said it's screwed um um yeah she must have been just like fuck that dude like for what already you know for what they, they should have uh they should have um tried to renegotiate a deal while um, before they fired her, they should have just pulled it aside and be like, you know, this, this, blah, 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 you know, blah, blah, you know, maybe she would have been down then, you know, because, you know, it was still before the actual firing, but after the actual, you know, this card, like, like, it doesn't really make sense to go back to something that didn't want you anymore, you know, but this is a movie, so, you know, money talks, so who knows in the future, you know, but as for now, I don't I don't think we're getting Scream 7 anymore or the Scream, the original story that we were going to get, you know, because we were we were really invested in the Carpenter storyline, you know, the Carpenter sisters. Um, um, I, I know it started off kind of rocky for Sam and Scream 5, but um, by Scream 6, everyone was pretty much cool with it, you know, and then look at the backlash now. Like first people were saying, oh, yeah, we don't like Sam. And now when she got when Melissa got fired, now everyone's all like, well, Sam, Sam, you know, we need Sam back. And um, it's it's just crazy to think, yeah, that it, it ended like this, you know, and we were really invested in their storyline. We never got to see who their mom was, you know, we never got to see who what she actually looked like or where she lived or where ever she goes around, you know, in Woodsboro. Um, uh, we never got to see Leslie Mocker and what she would have ended up looking like as well, you know. Um, so it's it's a lot of shit that just went down the drain with just this one little thing, you know. 
Um, and it's crazy to me because, like, like I said, Jasmine and Jenna were also posting pro, uh, what is it, Palestine? I forget already, Palestine or whatever. And they didn't get any backlash like that, you know? But especially Jasmine, she, she, since she's not as big as Jenna herself, you know, she's probably like on this on par with Melissa Barrera's fame, you know. But it's just weird that they would single her out like that, you know, it's just really weird. But, you know, I give her props still for standing by uh, her words and what she says. Um, she's coming out in another movie, like some kind of horror comedy monster movie. I got to uh, do that on the next uh, movie update. Um but yeah, like I said, yeah, it's 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 done for Scream right now, at least for the movies, you know. If they could get like a TV series going in between all this, that would be cool too. Maybe ending the Lakewood storyline. But as for the Carpenter story, it's it's done, dude. It, it's it's done. I don't I don't think it. I don't, I don't I don't think we could like salvage this this movie, you know. Like the only way I said last time is just to like. Um, just start with some new characters, but still mention Sam and Tara, but say they're off somewhere else, you know? Just like that, just write them out of the story, but don't kill the characters, you know? That's probably what they're going to have to do for now, you know? Have someone from, like, uh, like Sydney or or Kirby or someone make it, like, uh, or a Gale-centric story, you know? And just go off of there with them and just say that the core four is off somewhere in london or something at the meantime while these killings are happening you know because yeah that like i said it doesn't look like it's gonna happen if she herself like doesn't want shit to do with the studio then then that pretty much sums it up is she's not gonna be sam carpenter anymore that that's it for the carpenter sister storyline which was crazy because it was supposed to be a three movie uh it was supposed to be a trilogy a three-part story you know beginning middle and ending but well, damn like i always keep saying just like with scream 4 we never got that uh, that original um scream 5 with scream 5 we got scream 6 but we didn't get the scream 7 you know so it's like it's, it's crazy with scream 4 we didn't get scream 5 with scream with scream 6 we didn't get um scream 7 now and now it's probably gonna take at this point, it's probably is, is going to take a few years. Um, we're about to wrap it up now, but um, yeah, it, it's going to take some time before they're able to get Scream off the ground again. Probably, It's probably going to take about the same time as from 2011 Scream 4 to Scream 2022. Probably about 10-ish, 12-ish, 11 years, may, maybe. Maybe. If we're lucky, probably five, you know? But as for now, it's done. Um... The Sam Carpenter storyline, the Tara Carpenter storyline, the core four is over. It's no more. And uh, who knows what they're going to do now, you know? I don't, I don't know. I don't own the franchise, you know? If I, if, I, if I was able to do something, you know, I would uh, ask Melissa and Jenna if they'd be down to finish off the Carpenter storyline in a fan film, you know? Just to end the storyline since the studio doesn't want to end it and we us fans could produce it and fund it you know that's just a you know that's just a dream in my head but that would be awesome but anyways hollywood horror film club thank you again for joining me on another video please like and subscribe it really helps the channel hit the bell notification um comment below if you got any questions and uh keep sharing these videos and catch y'all next time